I'm already gonna cry and I literally just pushed play on this video. Okay, I have been preparing myself for this moment again to try to take another pregnancy test. <sighs> okay, I really have to pee, but that's besides the point. Um, I'm trying to be quiet because Josh is in the other room and again, I don't want him to know. So if you guys don't know and you're new to my channel, hi, I'm Cass and I recently, about two months ago, lost my baby in a miscarriage at around 14 weeks is when I miscarried. So yeah, I had a missed miscarriage and it is the first month that I'm able to take a pregnancy test again since. So it's kind of emotional for me. Yeah, and I basically just feel like I'm gonna cry because all the emotions are starting to come back. Okay. <laughs> I'm supposed to start my period, I believe in five days. And so I don't know if it's too early to take a pregnancy test or not. I think I'm fine. Yeah, I'm really not prepared to take another one this month. So like if it's too early and it says negative, I don't want to like take another one thinking there's not a chance. Like I don't know how to explain it, but oh, I'm just like nervous. I don't want like the disappointment twice this month, if that makes sense. That's what I was trying to say. Anyways, I'm like gonna cry. I need to check my app to make sure I'm like good to even I don't know, just to make sure things are okay. Oh, uh, I've already been here before and I don't, like, it's too soon to do this again, but at the same time, I'm like so excited and I like, wanna be pregnant again. So, it says my period is supposed to be in five days. So, yeah, I think it's fine, but I'm really, really nervous. Where's my headband? I gotta make this cuter. Okay, I found my headband. Not that it matters at all. I'm just freaking out, so, oh my gosh. I was pregnant, I miscarried, and yeah, this is our first baby. So uh, yeah, I was pregnant for the first time, and then we lost our very first baby, so we don't have any kids. And so this will be our first kid if I'm pregnant again. I don't know why I'm talking. Okay, I'm just gonna put on a little makeup because I am just really feeling so sad. So if I just do something that distracts me real quick, like putting on some makeup, <sighs> to feel a little better, I don't know. I just, I just don't really know how I'm feeling and I can't really explain it, and so I'm just putting on makeup. Why am I putting on makeup? I don't, I don't know. This is not the time to put on makeup, but I don't know, oh my gosh. And now I'm cleaning for some reason. I don't need to be cleaning right now, but I just feel like, oh. Okay, what am I doing? Okay, Cass, I'm talking to myself. If that's weird to you, sorry. Focus. I like don't want to feel the emotions, but like, I need to. Oh my gosh, sorry. I literally try to be funny and stuff when I feel emotional, but I need to actually like tap into my emotions and realize that it's okay to be, you know, a little bit sad. I'm just, I'm really, yeah. I'm just sad about the miscarriage and I am really excited to be pregnant again. Just think like if it's negative, then it's just gonna be sad because you know, <laughs> We had to wait about two, or I think it, I didn't remember exactly how long it's been. It's been three or two months, but we've had to wait that whole entire time to get pregnant again. I wanna say we, gosh, I can't remember the timing, but we've had to wait a while to try again. Then we got the clear this last month to try again. So it was our very first month to try. And I think I just have hope because like the doctors were like, you're super fertile, like after your miscarriage and like stuff like that. And so I'm like, okay, like I really want it to happen this time, but I don't know, I'm like really nervous. That's gonna be negative. But at the same time, I feel like I've been feeling weird and like my back's been hurting, my boobs have been hurting, like I don't know. Ugh. I just don't know if that's like something that's happened, like I don't know. I don't want to get my hopes up, you know? <sighs> I gotta find my pregnancy test because I really have to pee actually. So here's a brand new box. This would be the one I would have to take for it to get a right right reading. Let's see, I have this one that's six days sooner. So maybe I should take this one. Okay, I think I have to take this one. I don't know. Okay, I'm gonna take the six days sooner one because I'm supposed to start my period in six days. Gosh, I'm so nervous. I'm like shaking. <laughs> you guys see my hands? Oh, haven't seen one of these in a while. Okay, here it is. A nothing. Wait, do I pee on this? Or do I need to put it in a cup? I don't know. Okay, I found a cup. Not that you guys needed to know, but I'm gonna go pee in it. Okay, here we go. Okay, I peed in a cup. Oh, okay. 
I don't know if you guys need to know this, but my pee is really light. So I don't know if that's bad because I drank too much water. So maybe it won't detect. I don't know. Remove cap. Place tip in your urine stream for five seconds. Okay, here we go. One, two. <laughs> Sorry, I don't want to show you guys my pee. Three. I'm already shaking. Four, five. Okay, hopefully that was long enough. Uh, after three minutes, your result will be shown. Two lines for pregnant, one line for not. Okay. Set timer for three minutes. Okay. I set the timer. I feel like I'm doing this wrong because first off, you're supposed to take these in the morning because, well, I think you just get a better read in the morning because your HCG levels are higher. And if you drink like water, it kind of messes with it. So I don't know if I already did that wrong. And then another thing is it's kind of early, so I don't really know if that's bad, but I like can't wait this time. Usually I could like wait, this time I can't. So yeah, that's just kind of hard. Oh. Okay, I'm gonna say a prayer again because last time I said a prayer and I feel like it helped me, so especially if it's like negative, then I feel like it will help me to say a prayer. Just waiting. Oh, this is really hard again. It's hard to do this all again. <laughs> I should be thinking that way or if I should be thinking positive and then if it's negative I'd be really sad like I don't know what way to be thinking but I think I want to like guard myself and be like okay it's a negative like you were right like I don't know like it's just a, it's really hard after a miscarriage so I just want to say thank you to everyone who supported me through my past pregnancy journey and miscarriage it was really hard but I just want to say thank you and the timer is done so here we go okay this is like the worst moment or the best moment i don't know <sighs> two lines pregnant one line not this is like my cheat sheet okay two lines pregnant one line not i don't want to look at all for some reason <laughs> okay uh, and that's why i didn't want to look Not even a little line, just nothing. So, dang. <sighs> I don't know if I maybe took it too early. I don't know if I didn't, like my pee wasn't good. <laughs> I don't know, but I don't know. I might take one again in like a week and see, but. like pregnancy journey has been really hard. Didn't get pregnant for 11 months of trying. Finally got pregnant the 11 month. It was the best feeling in the world. Then was super sick and found out by the doctor that I was gonna lose our baby um, in a miscarriage pretty late on. Now we're just back to square one trying again. sad and hard but I know that this is God's plan for me and I know that when we do get our little baby that 
it's gonna be so worth it. I can't like lose hope and I don't know, I just gotta keep trying, keep praying, keep hoping that all of this will work out the way it's supposed to because if you don't think that way, then you might as well, you know, like you have to think positive in these kind of situations. It's hard and I don't think positive all the time, but I think I've just learned that if you think positive through things, then you know, it'll be so much better and you just gotta trust in God and I just think, just does you a lot of good to just think positive in any way that you can in situations that are hard or sad or are not what you want. So yeah, I didn't get what I wanted. First time taking a pregnancy test since my miscarriage, our first baby, and it's negative and it's okay. I'm sad about it, but that's okay because that's just how it is and that's God's plan. So I can't wait to be pregnant again with our little baby, but yeah, it's just not our time, not my time yet, so. I love you guys. Thanks for always like loving me and giving me hope and kind words. I just, I love you guys. So that's all I could say for now. Thank you for all the prayers and love. And yeah, I'm just glad you guys are on this journey with us. So I love you guys and I'll see you in the next video.